LeVar's back with us, but Marcellus, you Wake up, up first. Wake up, Bill. You giving the Patriots <laughs> any chance against the Chiefs? Yes, I'm giving them a chance. If they could do something that the Dallas Cowboys can't do, which is run the football. If you run the football against them, that gives the Patriots the best chance. Let's talk about the Patriots last week that ran the football against the Raiders. 250 yards last week. Going back in their contest against the Chiefs, the two wins that they had against the Chiefs, 2018, 170 yards in average in those two wins. Last year, they played the Chiefs under 100 yards in the Russian attack, and they lost that game. So when you're going against the Patriots, uh, you know one thing for sure. As uh, my guy, Mr. Bill Lenzoni, used to say, six Ps. Proper preparation prevents piss-poor performance. And guess what? You know when you play against the Patriots, they are going to be fully prepared. And they know how to attack your weakness. They saw the Raiders, and they attacked them on the ground. Now they see the, the Kansas City Chiefs coming in and forget the rankings. They know that their formula for success is, one, being surprising. The element of surprise. What's Cam Newton going to do? How is he going to be involved in the passing and running game? But more importantly, stay on the ground, because that's been our weapon of choice to beat the Chiefs. Proper preparation mm. prevents. prevents piss poor performance. That's cute. No, I mean, Peter Piper picked a pack of pit bull peppers, but what that got to do with what we're talking about right now, Marshall? I don't care about Peter proper Piper preparation. Did, did you mess that up? He was picking peppers. He was picking up peppers. And with Rob Rob. He was picking them. <laughs> Look, Marcellus, this is a hot tape. You have to give them a <laughs> chance because of Bill Belichick. But here's oh, what I'm going to say. I'm not going to say a lot. I'm just going to make it make sense and make it meaningful. It's very simple. Patrick Mahomes, 24-1 and one, when his defense allows 28 points or less. What that means is, Cam Newton, you got to score 28, 29 points just to get in the door. You got to get yourself four, really five touchdowns just to give yourself a shot at beating Patrick Mahomes. The reason I say Cam Newton is because he's accounted for six touchdowns of the Patriots. Next closest guy is accounted for two. So realistically, Cam Newton. It's on your back. Is your shoulders broad enough? Here's what it comes down to. Cam has accounted for five touchdown passes, three times, five touchdowns total, running or passing in one game, three yeah. times in his career, all in 2015. So it's really simple. Can Cam Newton put the team on his back and score 29 plus points? Because if you don't do that, you don't even have a fighter's chance at beating these Chiefs. Bill Belichick, he's a GOAT, brilliant offensive mind. Andy uh -huh. Reid has showed us he's also a GOAT. A off, a Bill Belichick, defensive mind, Andy Reid, offensive genius. The, the, the Chiefs, you got Kelsey. You have the plethora of receivers. What it comes down to is Bill Belichick's Patriots, they just don't have enough firepower. Mm. They just don't have enough weapons. Mm. Bill Belichick is a genius, but he doesn't step in between the 53 and the third white lines. Mm. So ultimately, yes, you give him a chance because of Coach Belichick. But Cam, mm. you just got to realize this. If you want to win a lotto, you got to buy a ticket. If you want to beat the Chiefs, you got to score at least 29 points. It's good luck. Mm. You know, I, I give them a chance because that's what mm. Sundays and Saturdays and Fridays that's are for. You play shoot up games. and you go out there and you got to see who's oh, going to go and, and want that's it more. You sometimes there are just certain things that you can't measure and you can't wait. This is a repeat of this last game that Chiefs just played. They're playing the same type of personality, the same type of personnel as point. the Ravens in this Patriots team. You got a running quarterback, dual threat quarterback. You you have a running attack with with dual uh, uh, running backs in the backfield, more than one one guy. Uh, they can throw the ball into the seams of intermediate passes uh, with what they're doing. I I look at this game and I really think that this is that opportunity. Cam was knocking on the door to say, "Look, pay attention to Cam." The Super Cam, Wakanda Forever Cam, is here. <laughs> and he mm. missed it by one yard. And, one and I yard. don't think that that was on him. I don't think that they messed this opportunity up, guys. They may not win the game, but I think they will come out and they will, they will show people a blueprint that has not been exposed yet by any team. And, and I, I really do believe that they will come with a game hey. plan that works in their favor. I always wondered, LeVar, what do coaches say when you know you're about to lose, and you just gave me yeah, an insight. I mean, well, yeah, I mean, like, well, that's we're not going to win the game, but yeah, that's we're going to uh, show Emmanuel, the that's what you, that's what <laughs> I Oh, said. you heard that? No, I didn't hear that. I heard Acho actually gives the, 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 the 
Patriots more ammunition to win this game. He said, you got to score at least 29 to win the lotto if you can, Newton. Well, all I see is a team that scored 30 two weeks ago and scored 36 last week. So not only are they going to buy a ticket, they're going to have multiple tickets to punch against this team. So, Acho. It's going to be a fun game. Yeah, it's going to be a fun game. You're going to yeah. see this one. Hey, Wakanda, Super Cam is on, on the bill. <laughs>